Well, hi, my name is May and this is Red Dead Redemption. I am incredibly excited to play this. Red Dead Redemption 2 is one of my favorite games. It's one of my most played games. I think I have 165 hours in it, which is a lot for me as someone who doesn't replay games very often. Um, I can't wait to get into this. I don't know anything about it. I know the combat's gonna be a little bit different. That's fine. Um, it will be a learning curve for me. But otherwise, yeah, I'm going into this completely blind. The only thing I know about it is that obviously it's about John, and it is after the events of Red Dead Redemption 2. So let's get into it. Just two quick disclaimers before we get into it. Um, I'm aware that this is rumored to be ported to PC at some point. I don't think it's as soon as people were saying, and I also don't think it'll be a remake. It seems like it's probably literally going to be this exact port, just on PC. I don't care enough to wait for it. I want to play it now. If it was a full remake, then I would not be playing this, um, but I don't think that's the case, so we're safe. And also, if you do not know me and this is your first time watching me play a story-based game, I do not talk during cutscenes. I might say like the odd thing here or there, but I respect what the characters are saying, so I shut the fuck up when they talk. Great, let's go. Not me looking at- oh, okay. I was like looking at every single face being like, do I know any of these people? I know that guy. I take it that's not our fancy ass car. <laughs> Would be nice though. Emotional. I don't even know how long it's been. I have no concept of the time difference. I'm sure I'll learn very fast, but... I don't seem to be in trouble. Yay! The game looks great so far. I'm very pleased. I'm grateful, Mrs. Bush, that they are finally bringing civilization to this savage land. I could not agree with you more, my dear. My daddy settled this land, and I know he'll be looking down on us, pleased at how we help the natives. <laughs> yes, they've lost their land, but they've gained access to heaven. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. Man. But father, do you mean unless an innocent receives communion, they're destined to go to hell? Uh, it hardly seems fair. Uh, what I mean to say, Jenny, is that there is a great deal of difference between an innocent and a savage. I never thought of it that way. Yes, they lived like animals, but they're happier now. Uh -huh. What the fuck? <laughs> Yikes. Starting off strong here. Not only do people now have motor cars, Father, but I heard that pretty soon we will be able to fly. No, only angels can fly, Jenny. No, no, apparently people can fly. Didn't you hear? Out in Kansas, a man even got a car to fly. <laughs> <laughs> I hardly think so, Jenny. Hey, Jenny, you dumb bitch. You're a child, you know nothing. <laughs> okay, so apparently, that- Apparently, Mr. Johns wants to run for governor which is why he's so concerned with cleaning up the state. Nate Johns 
Yes. His family is nothing but hillbilly trash that came here after the war. I don't want to be judgmental, <laughs> but this state should not be ruled by such a disgusting family. A family without class. Apparently. But John's family have made a lot of money, and he has a lot of friends in politics. Mrs. Bush, money isn't everything. There are many things that money cannot buy. It seems that money can buy voters, though. That's what rich people say. Money can't buy happiness. Mm -hmm. What okay. you must remember, my dear, is that we have been brought here to spread the word. And the word and civilization, they are the same thing. They are the gifts. It is the opportunity we have, the chance to live among people who are decent and who do not kill each other. And who let you worship in peace. Uh, it, it's so confusing, Father. Sometimes I find it impossible to make the distinction between a loving act and a hateful one. I mean, they often seem to be the same thing. Yes, Jenny, it, it is confusing. But you only have to ask me if you need help. Mm -hmm. Well, here we Indeed. are, Mrs. Bush. Armadillo. All right, well, let's get the fuck out of here with these awful people. <laughs> Away from them. Although I'm sure that everybody around here thinks the same way for the most part, so... I'm trying to remember Armadillo. I feel like... Are we still in Blackwater? Or did we leave Blackwater? Do we have a map? Who knows? Well, I'm sure we'll... We'll be told. Because um, I don't remember Armadillo. Ta hold X to sprint. Quickly tap X. Sorry, guys. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna sprint around a little bit. Oh, I'm so happy to be back in! And to... yeah. I did see, I thought I saw, yeah. A big X. Alright, John, I don't know what we're doing here. I don't know why the Pinkertons... oh! Oh! <laughs> you okay there, buddy? Oh, oh. Perhaps you should... Sleep it off, maybe. Will he get home safe? Who knows? That's the fun of the old west. Uh, I have no idea why the Pinkertons were like patting us on the back. Mr. Marfin! Mr. Marfin, over here! Does that not look exactly like Uncle? You must oh. be John Marfin. Just push her in Sometimes. the pits. Get out of here. I'm Jake. Your friends from Never Blackwater mind. hired me to guide you. They ain't my friends, but pleased to meet you, Jake. I got the horses saddled up and ready out front. All right, they ain't my friends, so. Jake, I need some more information. Ooh, I'm ready to ride. You ain't gonna find sturdier horses than these in all of New Austin. Okay, New Austin is the post, like, epilogue place, right? Like, that's where Blackwater is and all that shit. So we are there still. How do I. Uh, how do I. Same as sprint, probably, right? Same as run? Yeah, there we go. I have heard the horses are really, really fast in this. <laughs> Comparatively. How do I- oh! Ah! Ah! That was the wrong- <gasps> I pulled out my gun! Get out of here! Nope! How do I- oh fuck. How do I put it away? I don't want to upset anybody. Sorry, Jake. I'm sorry you had to see that. You want to visit? That's right. it's, a, it's a lot to get into. I ain't a decent fella. It's been abandoned yeah. for years now. Folks say it was built during the Mexican War. What kinds of soldiers around back then? Why'd they leave? Well, I ain't entirely sure. I, I heard they had to go up north to fight Indians, or maybe they got tired of being soldiers and went looking for gold. You know how things is. I so I can't say I do. I'm looking for an old friend. Well, like I says, you ain't gonna find many folk around those parts these days. 
knows you do find about as sociable as an ulcerated back to <laughs> I mean, I ain't one to judge a man by the company he keeps, but... Well, he ain't been friends for a long time. Mm. Perhaps it is Billiam that we just heard about? Okay, sorry, I was trying to read and I was trying to read tutorial and subtitles at the same time. Well, if you're fixing for some female company, you can do a lot worse than Armadillo. Fine as cream gravy they are. Not like Thieves Landing. Dang, those girls ain't even fit for a drinking man to hold up with. I'm a married man, I'm afraid. Ain't we all? <laughs> oh man, oh man. Thanks for the uh, the tips there, Jake. We're really like thrown into it. I I don't even know how to do anything. Yeah. So it was the marshal who hired me, Lee Johnson. Do you know him? Oh. I think I heard his name. Says he got a telegram from some Blackwater big bugs asking for a guy. I guess it's none of my business. That's right. <laughs> it isn't your business. I like this guy. I hope he doesn't die right away. Feel, he feels like too friendly of a character to live. <laughs> you ain't really talkative, are you? Nope. I'm just chewing the dog, mister. It's how I am. I don't mean nothing by it. Trust me. There's things you're better off not knowing. That's true. I mean, look at me, Jake. Damn coyotes. Oh. What a waste of good meat. Hold, hold. Ah! Not far now. Oh, I don't like Look that. see the fort when you get to the top of this hill. I don't like that it turns like that. I feel like it'll help. It'll fuck me up all right. Deal. Blow it up now. Listen, mister. This here is what's left of Fort Mercer. Some gang rode in and took the place over. Mm. So I understand. This is where we part ways, friend. You have yourself a good time. <laughs> Thanks for your support, Jake. I don't think this is a good idea at all. Bye, my lonesome. I don't even know how many people are in there. It could be a lot. I'm not ready for a shootout. I'm too green. Let me shoot some fucking bottles or something first before we get right into a altercation. How do I get off my horse? I don't know. Oh! Whoa, Nelly. Oh! Okay. You stay there. I hope you don't get killed. I don't see anybody. Just some crows. for you Bill Williamson come out here right now surely Go people know we're here now, okay yeah John. don't make me kill you nobody needs to kill anyone Bill you must think I was born yesterday you always did think I was an idiot that ain't fair Bill you were as my brother. I've come to try to save you. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. Do I look like I need saving? Bill, please. They want to kill us all. I can help you. Well, you never tried to save me before. Bitch, you I can say the same about you. To save yourself. <laughs> Bill. I implore you think about this. <laughs> you implore me? <laughs> you implore me. You always were one for fancy words. <laughs> oh. Well, things are different now, John. Now I'm in charge. No more Dutch. And no more you. <sighs> Implored. <laughs> <laughs> 
I, I implores you to go back and tell them to send someone just a little bit more impressive next time. Oh. Well? Oh, no. Uh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Poor John. John, come on. Also, Bill, shoot him more than once, you dum dum. Oh, I'm ragdolled. <laughs> oh no. That's rough. That's a risky maneuver. Do I know you people? She kind of looks like one of the women on the train. There was a woman sitting in front of the um, priest man and I'm assuming his daughter. There was a woman and she looked just like that, but maybe it's just the same like character model or something. I can't really tell. Yeah, you, right? Very well, similar. Alive. So it would seem. So how do you feel? I don't know the polite word for it. I do. Stupid is the word we use around here. What were you doing? I was... Oh, I was doing something stupid. Well, you'll be okay. Once you didn't die, the doctor said you'd be fine. He got the bullets out a couple days ago. Good. It cost us $15. I'm sorry, madam. You should have left me there to die. Did you want to die? I mean, was that it? Was that why you went straight out to Fort Mercer and picked a fight with the worst bandit in the county? To die, Mr. Er, Mr. Uh, Marston. John Marston. Bonnie McFarlane. Miss Bonnie McFarlane. Well, you may be right, Miss McFarlane. I don't know. Huh. So what were you doing? I was trying to give Mr. Williamson a chance. For old time's sake. You know Bill Williamson? Knew him. Long time ago. Well, what was he like? Dumb. Just like you. Thank you, miss. <laughs> you see my hat? I have. <laughs> and, uh, what will you do now? <laughs> now I'm gonna take my time and go after him the less kind way. Well, that sounds very fun, Mr. Marston. Quite heroic. Just like in those penny dreadfuls my brother used to read. Meanwhile, if you'll excuse me, I've got a ranch to run. Of course, if you're feeling better, why not take a ride with me later? Help me patrol the perimeter. You can earn back some of that money we wasted on doctor's bills. Of course. And thank you for saving my life, I mean. Next time, Mr. Marston, I strongly recommend you don't try to lose it quite so earnestly. I'll bear that in mind. I like her. Honest. I am a little bit weirded out that, like, why, if Fort Mercer is so dangerous, why was her and her companion, whoever that was, why were they riding so close to it? Like, I'd be avoiding that road, you know? But, whatever. Okay, so we gotta pay off our shit. Is this gonna be our little house? Whoa! I don't know if I can- can I greet people? I used to love doing that. I don't know why. It made me feel good. Maybe I'll explore a little bit. Blacksmith? I feel like I should not be out and about. It's only been a couple days. Like I definitely should not be- I know it's the wild west and you know you kind of- you're, you're tough and shit but I would not be hopping on a horse anytime soon. Hello. Sorry Bonnie's this way. Well, I'm grateful that you saved me, but I'm kind of- it's strange. I feel like it's not common to see nice people just willing to risk their lives like that. I'm just a suspicious person though. Where is she? Oh, there she is. Mr. Hey, Bonnie. Back in the land of the living, I see. 
Yeah, it's been about two minutes. It's about time so. I started paying back that fifteen dollars. Well, no time to waste. The horses are saddled up over here. Alrighty. I figure I have time to explore this area after. I don't know. Maybe they wanted me to do that. I'm ready just to get. I'm ready to earn my keep. There's the foreman's office. It's also where we lock up good for nothing outlaws such as yourself. Oh, literally right in front I'm of us. I'm happy enough with my current quarters right now, Miss McFarland. I picked out a fine horse for you. Whoa! Well, she's being awfully kind. Come on, time horses to are not cheap. Real ranch looks like. I think I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna rack up a debt with this woman. Yeah. Where are we going? Over right. This way. Hold X to master speed. Gotcha. To your right is the general store. You won't find Parisian high fashion, but it's good for the essentials. Very convenient. I don't think I've ever seen a ranch with its own store before. Yeah, this is a very large, like, little commune we got here. And you own all this? And here's the corral. This one's for the horses. What do you think? I'm no expert, but it certainly looks like a fine corral. I suspect you've stolen yes. more horses than you've broken. <laughs> now where'd you Who, get me? such an idea? <laughs> First impressions are hard to erase. You're crazy! What do you mean? You're right, but... Um, I like... Crazy. She's not afraid to say Things shit sure like that. Since the line finally got I don't finished. like... Oh, see? How the fuck would I... Like ah! Well. Why is he going so fast? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know you were just gonna... I didn't know you were gonna turn so fast. See, that's the problem. I don't like looking at stuff because it completely disorients me. Sorry, I'm back. I apologize, Bonnie. Um, I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh, we got some cattle. Yeah! You're enthusiastic. Yeah, I'm that holding my side. Ouch. Paul built it himself when I was just a little girl. Oh. Oh, she- it was- okay. So you didn't build this place from the ground up. You're just, uh... And here we are, back at the house. Let's stop for a while oh, that was it. head out on patrol. You'll get oh. no complaints from me, Miss McFarland. Alright. Thanks for the ride. Tore open my stitches, I'm bleeding on, all over. Fight. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. She's- she's so fast! Here I am, just minding my business. All right, I apologize. <sighs> How about a cold drink, Mr. Marston? Thank you, ma'am. Getting shot, then riding a horse seems to take it out of you. <laughs> mm-hmm. I could use a rest. Sure, come on in. I'll show you the house, and then you can sit for a while. Thank you. She's so friendly. I don't like it. I do like it, but it makes me, I'm a very suspicious person. Mr. Marston. Miss McFarland. Remember me telling you about the trouble we've been having with rustlers and other undesirables? I do. Will you help me keep watch on the property line this evening? Sure. I want to see just who is trespassing on our land. We have experience with this. Weapon. Come, let's head out. The country is really beautiful at around this time. Oh, dear. I said I wanted to We'd shoot cans first. This is a dangerous time of night for us. How, like, where are your ranch hands? Is that one? Like, surely other people are doing perimeter sweeps. And not just us. Wow, the sky looks so great. Everything looks so good. Right, follow me. Keep your eyes peeled for anything suspicious. Oh, oh dear. Sorry. So I did, um, I did turn on normal mode for the Thank gunplay. Thank you, Mr. Marston. I feel a lot happier someone's along with me. I feel a lot happier now I got a rifle. Well, with your trigger itch and my feminine intuition, we should make quite a team. Because I've heard, um, is it easy or whatever mode? It's really, it just like locks to the head automatically and it can make it feel jarring. I don't know. I'm not afraid to switch back though, so. <laughs> It's, I'll, I'll see how I feel about it. I've never been good at shooting with a controller, Look, so. those damn rabbits are at the crops again. Get down and give me a hand, will you? 
Oh, we're gonna. Oh, we're gonna start with rabbits. Get your rifle out. Lovely. It's about time these little thieves um, met their maker. Oh, oh, hi! Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, so it's a little bit on the slower side for sure. Oh, fuck. Sorry. I'm gonna take my time for now just to like. I think the sensitivity needs to be fixed. Oh, sorry. Kill those little varmints. Why is there so many? Why are they unafraid? I'm gonna fix the sensitivity. It feels so. Oh. Did you run away? You're a good shot, Mr. Marston. That rabbit didn't stand a chance. Let's get I'm back a good, on the horses and see what else but is going slow on. shot. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get a little bit snappier. I'm thinking that wasn't terrible, but I was being too cautious. Should I try to fuck around with the settings right now? Maybe I'll try to like mess with sensitivity. It just felt super slow. Um, higher? I don't know. I'm so used to uh, like whenever I used to you play games with guns it was always on um, mouse and keyboard so I'm just very unfamiliar with this. Let's get going. We've still got plenty of ground to cover. What's that over there? Oh, bunnies? Yeah. More bunnies, I think. If it's not the rustler stealing our cattle, it's the rabbit stealing our crops. It ain't never easy living off the land like this. Maybe you should move to a big city, become a lady of leisure. What happened to our little ranch? Look out! Coyotes! Shoot them before they get to oh. the animals! Oh, oh, oh. Come on! Do I need to be on the horse for that? Because I don't think this would be a good time. Incredible! Where? <gasps> I see you. I see you. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Please. Oh, this is this is okay. I lost my my good grace. Nope, that's not how you. Excuse me. I got too confident and I missed the easiest possible shot. Where'd you go? There, there, there. There's one over here too. Oh, you were going slow. You were letting me have that one, eh? Oh. What? Ah! Maybe it's too high of sensitivity. Oh, dear. <gasps> oh, we had a chicken, I think. <gasps> oh, you also had a chicken. Oh. Oh. Is there any more? Oh, there's a big... Maybe look, at, look at the fucking mini-map. <gasps> oh. Okay, chicken owning 101. I have personally have never owned chickens. Um, I live in an apartment. However, are you not supposed to put them in the coop for the night and lock the fucking coop? You're asking for trouble here. This is this is not on John. This is on you. Like you literally you put them in their little homes and you lock it up and then you let them out. <sighs> Do you have anything on you? I thought I saw a little sparkle. Honestly, Bonnie, I'm not telling you how to do your shit, but like, think about it a little bit. We could be saving these chickens. There we are. Okay, performance. It's been better. It's been better. Uh, oh, oh, sorry. Come on. We'll figure it out. Do I name this horse? Do I get attached to this horse, or is this a temporary horse? Do I care enough? All right. Three chickens down. There'll be more gone tomorrow. Yeah, like, there's no one around. I feel like there should be more ranchers. We need some night patrol here. You have nothing to say, Bonnie? About my criticisms you, of how Mr. you do your, your chicken keeping? That's it, we're done for the night? Oh god, I thought it was gonna be like progress even more Thank and then there's gonna help, be people. Mr. 
Makes me kind of happy I saved your life. Get some sleep and I will see you in the morning. Good night, Miss McFarlane. I definitely think I owe you more than that. You gave me a horse and a place to sleep. I should be doing some work for at least a couple. I sleep you'll wake up. Who's talking right now? There was no one out. Okay, so this is our home base. Great. That's helpful. Oh, Deadeye. I forgot about Deadeye. Fame, honor. Ooh. They're giving me so much information at once. Who is shooting? I heard shooting, right? Some, some people even deal valuable information about the surroundings in the form of maps or newspapers. Okay, it seems like we've unlocked everything. Four horse feed. Oh, okay. So this is we like we own this horse. Okay, this is our horse. Great. Thank you. Kit, basic campfire. Refills revolver and repeater ammunition ammunition if you have none. Great. Provisions, we got none. How are we map? Whoa. Zoom. Okay, armadillos where we started. I do not know where we are. 1910? Is it 1910? So I think it was... Was it 19... Or, or it was 1899? In Red Dead Redemption 2, I think. But then, the end, it was like seven years later, wasn't it? Because Jack was big as fuck. Which... What happened to our family? What happened to our ranch? It's not good. Okay, I guess there's no point in looking at that. I just wanted a little bit of some context. We have a journal as well. Oh, this is of oh, the brief. Challenges. Telling us about stranger side quests. Okay. Should we just be sleeping? I mean, it suggested that we sleep. I was just curious who the fuck randomly was talking. Was it you? Talking to yourself? Good sir. It sounded like it was like right around here. Hmm. Alright, let's sleep. We'll start fresh in the morning. <gasps> A dog? Hello? Hi! Hi! Am I gonna scare you off? Hi, hi, hi. Hi, nice to see you. I don't think I can do anything with you, but I appreciate that you're here. Where were you? Trying to, like, not here to scare off the coyotes or anything. We need some guardian dogs here. Okay. Bon bon? Obstacles in our path. Oh, Mr. Marston. How are you doing today? I'm well, Miss McFarlane. Thank you. How are you? Should've well, looked. I'm fine. Thank you. So, uh, how are your ribs? Fine. A little sore, but apart from a couple extra scars, it'll be as nothing happened. Good. Uh, come in, come in. You know, you never did tell me how you met that Bill Williamson or what you wanted from him. No, miss, I did not. Well, why not, if you don't mind me asking? I certainly don't mind you asking if you don't mind me not telling. See, it's a complicated and somewhat pathetic tale, and by telling you, not only would I be putting your life in danger, but also threatening the lives of some people that I hold very dear. Well, I apologize if I seem to be prying. And I apologize for my reticence. Hope you believe me when I say that it's simply out of respect for you. Of course, Mr. Marston. I feel like she I knows more. I understand that a city dweller such as yourself likes to have some exotic secrets so us country folk are impressed. <laughs> I'm no city man, miss. Yeah, but I saw you get on the train at Blackwater. You with those gentlemen in bowler hats? I'm still no city man. But I'll bet you can't ride, Mr. Marston. I hate to take money from a lady, miss. <laughs> Oh, you won't be. I'll race you right now. If it makes you happy. We'll see. So that was her on the train. Why is he not suspicious of that? I'd be like, are you following me, you crazy right, woman? I'll tell you how we ride around these parts. Is she just so happened to stop by 
at the fort after I got shot down when she saw me on the train going on with the Pinkerton. She knows so much shit. And John's like, well, okay. He's trying to be like, not, not trust people, yeah. but then this woman is full on telling him that she's lightly stalking him or something's happening. Oh, oh I thought he was going to run with me. On the count of three. Three, two, one. Oh no. One, oh. Go! I ah! you're not going to be a gentleman about this. You don't know me at all, Miss McFarland. Fuck you, bitch. Yeah. <gasps> oh, Apparently you can get way too excitable. Oh, I had no stamina. Was that what it was? Let's go. I was so excited about it. Oh my god, she's so far. There's no way. of extra speed, so don't keep. She's gonna Let's go. beat my ass. It goes back pretty fast. Come on! Bonnie! Bonnie, you know this place way better than I do. Oh, that's fence. Um, there's some wolves! Come on. Am I supposed to be dealing with those? don't like that we're racing. Well, on roads and horse trails. Okay. Let me see. Yeah, holy. Oh, uh, this way? Oh. <gasps> A deer! Wow, we're getting so much wildlife right now. I wasn't paying attention. Bitch. I'm so sorry. My horse doesn't respect me. Honestly, it's... <gasps> She's long gone. I think the way I'm I'm seeing this is like the Witcher horse races, where it's just like it feels like you could spam way more. This is a long ass race. Well, he's not gonna respect go. me as a man after this. That's all right. Is the longest fucking race. It's so windy. It's so windy. Oh, these bells. Bonnie, did you start all these mini fires? Because I gotta say, it's not the smartest idea. It's, it seems unwise in a desert setting with a bunch of just dry tinder. Hurt me! Fire hurts. More at 11. Let's go! Come on! This is really just a tour, hey? Let's show us the entire area. She's been she's been here for about wait for me for about 30 minutes now. I almost got that dog. Whoa, whoa. She got herself a mani-pedi while waiting for me. <laughs> that was fun. Sure. Was you know, you should go pay the marshal a visit in Armadillo sometime. I'm sure he could help you deal with that nice Mr. Williamson. Yeah, I might just do that, Miss McFarland. You do whatever you think best, Mr. Marston. Why did that give me fame? It shouldn't have. It's embarrassing. I feel like Lee Johnson... It's an incredibly familiar name. That's the problem with this, is as much as I love Red Dead 2, my memory is so garbage that I'm sure there's going to be a lot of characters and places that I just don't pick up on right away because I, I've forgotten. Um, but, you know, it is what it is. We'll see. No, that's the wrong thing. I always want to say that that's the map button, but it's not. So I guess I'll ride out to go see him. 
It doesn't seem like there's anything to do here. Ooh, waypoint. I see. Okay. I still have so many questions for Bonnie, but I guess we don't care. Let's let's check. Uh, we have no money, I don't think, but let's just take a gander in here. Are you? Why are your so eyes you like, like that? Drew oh, it's his glasses. You got a, some cleaning to do there, buddy. It's looking sparse in here. Seems like something sparse. big hanging in the air. Could be good or bad. Well, I, I don't need to check with him. That's okay. But what about there was a blacksmith for here? I guess you don't really do anything for me, hey? You just kind of make random shit. It's not going to be weapons or anything. Alright, I'm just stalling. We should just go straight to Armadillo, go see Lee Johnson, see if I remember him. I'm pretty sure- I feel like very much so he's a, he was a character. Um, so. Let's go there. This is my horse? This is not my horse. This is my horse. It's waiting here as if it's my horse. So, it, why is it not marked on the map? No one's yelling at me for stealing a horse, so I'm gonna assume it's fine. Alright, unless I can fast travel, can I? No, it doesn't seem- it doesn't seem that way. Yeah. Let's go! Howdy, partner. I kind of want to just go explore random houses and stuff and see what happens, but let me get more settled into the open world and then we'll see how things go, because I love side quests. I will do so many. Oh. There's shooting going on. Come on, easy up there. Who's shooting? My horse does not like it. Is there someone in the field over there? There is. I just... You can save from anywhere in the wilderness. Ooh, do you have to sleep to save? There's no quick save, hey? Where is there? Game? No. Okay. Alright, I have heard saving is vital because... You can end up- Oh! You can end up getting, I don't know, fucking up side quests really easily or something. I've earned the loyalty of my mount. Great, thanks. That's lovely. You think this man will shoot me if I come up to him? How good are you with iron? Uh, I bet you can't beat Ira Shelton in shooting. I'll bet you money. Are you talking about yourself in third person? Honestly, my shooting- Oh! That's why I was X'd out on the mini-map. I don't even have $13 to my name. So sorry, I'm in debt. Um, I'll get back to you, maybe one day. Because it would actually be a good- It would probably be good to practice. <gasps> yeah. There's people racing! What are you guys up to? Shenanigans? We're just gonna keep going. I'm sorry. Uh, I'll get distracted by everything all day. And I just- I can't. I simply can't. Here we are in all its glory. Suppose I shall hitch- oh yeah, right here. Hola. Oh. Doesn't do a good job of uh, turning tightly. <laughs> Okay, let's go see Lee Johnson. Marshall Johnson. Is that their marshals, right? Sheriff? I don't know. Excuse me. Hey! Hey! You got a visitor! <coughs> <laughs> Shut up, you! Now what you want? My name's John Marston. You wanted to speak to me. I did. 
Apparently so. Why? I guess because we're both in the business of the law. Perhaps I was wrong. <laughs> you that fella from the train company? No, I'm from Fort Mercer. Fort Mercer? You them, one of them Williamson boys. Calm down. Go on, shoot him, mister. Shoot him. <laughs> Come what? You, you getting cute with me, boy? What's going on here? <clears throat> I got me one of them Williamson boys. I got me one of them idiots who give marshals a bad name. Oh, no. Put your gun down. You must be the man from Blackwater. So much spitting. Yes, sir. Listen, that dog ain't too bright, but he seems loyal. Jonah, get out of here for a minute. Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson, sir. And you. Oh, I done seen enough of your hide around here, friend. <laughs> I think there's some school children down the way you can go and frighten. Oh, hardy fucking har. <laughs> what are you doing here, Mr. Marston? Apart from frightening my deputies. I urge I'm you here to reconsider to capture that position. Kill Bill Williamson. <laughs> okay. Can you help me? He's outside my jurisdiction. He's in the next county. Of course, Bill Williamson and his boys have tended to keep themselves away from my town. So you're happy to have him out there? Well, I ain't happy, but I also ain't suicidal. My job is to keep this town safe, not clean up all of these three counties. It's hard enough around here. You know, I hear you speak, and suddenly I'm reminded of how some of the people I respected most in my life had a problem with authority. What's wrong with you? Well, I'm sure you and your fine friends have enjoyed spending your time running around pursuing noble causes. My cause is to keep this town from turning into a living hell for the folks who live here. The whole world has problems, mister, and I'm here doing what I can. Why? What's happening? Right now? I got the railway, the people who pay my salary, trying to get me to turn a blind eye to them burning down settlements up there. I got a bunch of cattle rustlers out near Box Canyon needs shutting down. Not forgetting the gang that keeps murdering homesteaders out in the back country. And I got a bunch of hoods over in the saloon, drunk, threatening to shoot up the whole town. That's all I got today. But it's early yet. Give me a couple more days. There'll be more. All right. Tell you what. Let's go deal with them hoods in the saloon. Then we'll discuss Williamson. Okay, boy. You're a persistent little cuss, ain't you? <laughs> Only when things matter. I like him. Come on, then, Marston. I don't know if he's Follow someone me. that I was supposed to know. I don't know why the the name was so familiar to me, but. I don't know. I could be crazy. Okay, are we gonna Who be we shooting folks? For? A bunch of two-bit hoodlums, led by this fella called Walt. Goddamn road agents who prey on the stages coming in and out of town. Drivers and armadillos spend more time with their hands in the air than on the reins these days. And you're happy to let them drink in your saloon? Happy? No. But the way I figure it, better they're carousing in there than out robbing decent folk. That's an interesting approach to law enforcement. <laughs> John, he's got a lot. He's got a lot of judgment. I mean, me too. But it's funny. He's so Stump bold with it. Bastard now. Just poison their fucking beer. Is it ethical? But see what kind of hole he crawls into. You know. You could get away with a lot of shit back then. So. Let's go, Marston. I've been after that son of a bitch for months. Oh, here he goes. Oh, I've learned to whistle for my horse. He spotted you. Stay on him, boy. Um, pardon me? That trail, boy. Catch up with me when you can. Okay, what? What? Ah! Fucking. How did he spot me? Come Do on. not kill Walton. 
Because that ain't how the law works. Is that right, Marshal? And alive, he can still talk. Doesn't sound like he's a man to be reasoned with. He ain't. But a few days of my hospitality, and he'll be telling me what I need to know. Walt's gang's been growing fast. Outlawing's easy money for easy work. Chola Spring, Gap Tooth Ridge, these boys get around. Walt's a start, but there's plenty more where he came from. I feel like it's very optimistic to think he'll talk if you bring him in, but that's that's not my bit. It's not my business. I'm just here to help. Yeah. Hold up, Marston. He must be at the old Pleasant's house. Probably best we take it on foot from here. I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> Sheriff, I'm not cut out for Looks this. Looks like oh. we got company, boys. <laughs> They knew right away. <laughs> Damn. Take cover. We'll work our way up this hill. Oh dear. Hey, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Marston, I got you covered. Move up to that wagon. Oh, uh There's one behind the crate. Take him down. You ain't that tough, Walt. Oh god. Oh. Okay. Sorry. You ain't I was hoping me alive. Oh my god. The whole why? Am I, I am I losing my mind? Am I too close? He's not putting his gun out. Do I have to be out of cover? I guess. I can't shoot well in cover. Head for the crate, boy. I'll cover you. I'm very confused. He doesn't. He doesn't move gracefully. Yeah, I can't. I don't understand. I'm gonna get myself killed. So while it's over low cover and press. Uh, I, I didn't. I am sorry. Why does he walk so fucking slow? Sorry guys. This initial learning curve is gonna be. has a bounty on him. Take him alive. Let's see if we can take him alive. Gotta say. Oh! Oh! Fuck. Oh my god, he decimated me. I was trying to hit him in the knee. Retry from checkpoint. I guess we'll find out how far the checkpoints are. <laughs> Panic! I need a shotgun! Take cover behind that wagon to your right! Well, this is good practice. It's so weird that I can't shoot. I, I'm obviously not Yo, getting something. Got you, bitch. You couldn't shoot a oh, oh shit, he's still alive. I'm not sure. He was really flailing around. Now move up to that crate. I'll cover you. Come on. I was gonna try to. I am, it's not going well for me. Oh, a little slide. I was trying to do the vault over. Oh. There! So I have to, sorry, I'm so sorry. Did he get enough? So I have to use. Oh, okay. Apologies. So I have to hit. I have to hit. Right. Why am I not getting him? That was that was a direct hit. Painful. This is. 
Looks like the guy in front of me is no longer living. He is! He was frozen. Something happened. I'm struggling. What is happening with you? Bye bye. Shit or get off the pot. I'm really struggling with the cover thing, but. Oh, you were still. You guys are both still alive. Shooting him in the butt. The guy behind that I had tried to shoot earlier, I guess. Somewhere over here. There you are. Oh! Sorry, use this. There we go. Wow! I apologize for that horrid performance. I've just Oh! Wow! He was already out! He's making a run for it! Take him alive if you can! How how do I It'll be trial and the rope for Okay. Okay. <laughs> Not a bad shot, Mr. Marston. It will get better. Why don't you check hopefully. in with me next time you're in town. I don't want to be no policeman, Marshal. <laughs> Nor did I, my friend. I can promise you that. I'll see you soon, Mr. Marston. Don't compliment me for that. Okay, we're gonna have to, uh... Learn more about shooting and cover. Oh. A whole $20. And now I can... Give that to pay off my debt. Open container right here. Gang outfit. I possibly be a owner. Who is that? Hello? Don't know who that was. Okay. Presumably, yeah, looting's not going to be as in depth as the second one. Marshall's left you a long way from civilization. You can quickly travel back to town using the travel destination feature of your camp. Open your satchel and choose the camp item. I should be saving. It's definitely loot. Whoa. What is happening over here? I, there's... It's like all of a sudden the mission ended and they were like, let's spawn in so many things. It's fine. Is this my horse over here? Now, do we want to explore explore a little bit? Or do we want... Actually, we should probably be making camp right now to save. Let's experiment with that here. Kit. Pretty self-explanatory. Uh, it said I got a new outfit. Oh. Ooh. Okay, there's lots. Walton's gang outfit. Oh, so it unlocked the possibility to... I see. To get this full outfit. So it gives you... So I... I got one of them i see that's pretty cool i'm not typically one to care too much about outfits um but if there's some i did like hear that outfits in this are more important because they can give you different perks and stuff so 
Perhaps I will look into that. Like what deadly assassin. I wish it told you what um, the benefits were. Because then I could decide if I actually felt like it was worth pursuing. Um, if anybody has tips. I looked up like a generic list of like tips for this just like for the differences between the second one and this one and basically like it was mostly about yeah like normal or expert gun play is the best which i'm not so sure um horses die easily and you can't get them back so like be aware of that and they're very fast i can't remember there's a couple other things save often because side quests are easy to fuck up that kind of thing so if you guys have any other tips for me that would be lovely i hate that there's only three save slots because i like to have so many saves obnoxious like it's obnoxious how many saves i want <laughs> for baldur's gate oh, fuck i can't even remember how many saves i had like a stupid amount it was it was hundreds of saves because i was like who knows anything could happen Anything could happen. Okay, um... Sorry, I always do that. So we could just go... Straight back to Armadillo. It doesn't seem like we have anything to do really at this moment. Right? Yeah, like it's just saying... Check in with me next time you're in town. We can go check on Bonnie. Let's just... Oh, you can only fast... Can you only fast travel via campfire? Probably, right? I already ended mine. Alright, we're just gonna ride back then. Explore the land a little bit. See if we run into some fun people. It's not that far. We'll make it. Um, reset waypoint. Let's go! Actually, now we have money to to sh play with that, that shooting game with that guy. But that's not really gonna- I mean, it would help me get better, but it seems like my brain broke trying to use cover. So I should probably focus on trying to learn how to shoot while in cover. I would love to know how fast time moves. And I would love if we could uh, choose how long you want to sleep. Because now it's like 3 a.m. And I can't do anything with Bonnie until 5. I don't even know if I have a mission with her. I just thought I would check in and see. And then if not, we would go back to Lee. I know I have lots of opportunity to explore. I just thought I'd give like this first little bit just to see what, you know, what there is to do. I know we have this here, so maybe we can check in. Maybe there's some bounties we could do. Perhaps. So let's pick up the base here. This is where you wanted me anyway. <laughs> Follow Charlie. He's a good one to sniff out trouble. Stay <gasps> close to Charlie. Okay. Stop all criminals you encounter by any means necessary. Oh. Any means necessary. Let's go, Charlie. If anything happens to this dog, I'll lose my fucking mind. How many criminals are gonna be out and about? Are we talking within? Within the ranch? Or... External factors. What's happening? Sorry. I'm back, buddy. Thought there was something over there. Keep up with Charlie. He's not going very fast, so. Howdy, mister. I'll just do it myself if, if he can't. I still haven't looked up to see, but. Charlie, where were you when the chickens needed saving? Okay. 
Where were you with the rabbits? Seems pretty convenient that he was snoozing away. Are you saying that to me? That I'm looking good? Perhaps that man is just drunk. Get away from me! What was that, boy? It's not sounding good. Hey! I got Oh my god! Oh no. These could this is fucking funny. The- I just- I just clicked buttons. I didn't think he was gonna pull out his fucking repeater. <gasps> Holy shit, Charlie. Oh my god, Charlie was a witness too. These could easily be contributing members of society just having a minor altercation. <gasps> I went in guns blazing. I don't know how to fist fight. I just- I didn't even have my gun in my hand. Oh my god. I'm a terrible person. <gasps> Do I loot them? Like, I mean... What if... The unemployment rate just shot up on this fucking ranch. I'm so sorry. Baller twins. Guys, I... Honestly, it was... It was an accident. How the fuck was I supposed to break up the fight? I just ran to them and clicked the wrong buttons. <sighs> it happened so fast. I mean, I've I've always been a cold-blooded killer, but good god. Actually, I'm not going to say always, but you know, I've done some nefarious things, but truly that was probably the worst. I don't even know what they were fighting about. One of them could have stole the other guy's sock and he got mad. Oh, Charlie. Charlie, I'm t I'm ready to move on. Do you think I got in trouble? It, it happened so fast, my brain didn't even fucking process what was going on. I mean, no one's coming after me. You failed to stop any crimes. So I ended the mission by doing that? Do I start again? <laughs> I really don't like that I did that. It's fucking funny. Don't get me wrong, it's hilarious. But what the fuck? I think I might just- I might- I might just go back. I might do a little save scum. I'm not gonna lie, because... That's just not a good look. It's not a good look for me. At all. Um, uh, auto save. Was that just now? What time is it? It was just now. Um, we're gonna we're gonna start again. All right. Uh, ready to stop crime. I was born ready. We are gonna. Treat these criminals respectfully with Charlie. Mm -hmm. It's fine. It's, He's a good it's okay. One to sniff our trouble. Stick next to the dog, mister. Oh, I'm... I'm... I don't know what to do. All By any means necessary. I- technically, I followed the rules. <laughs> I- It was any means necessary, it was just maybe, perhaps, not the right call. More of a reflex than anything. More of a button fumble than a true, well thought out way to deal with these criminals. Is this randomly generated or is it gonna be the same guys? Because it seems like his pathing is different. So maybe it'll be another- it'll be some other criminals I can stop in a less lethal manner. Yikes. It's a big yikes. Charlie, you're taking me fucking nowhere. 
Oh, oh, I didn't think I was gonna be able to hit. Oh. This dog. He's cute, but he's. He's not the brightest. But neither am I, so I guess we're we're a fitting team. Come on, let's go. Why is my health so low? I just woke up. Am I losing my mind? <gasps> a horse thief! How do I- Get him! Charlie, get him! How do you fight? Why aren't you telling me? Do I have a lasso? Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. He won't. He's not intimidated by me. He just goes to cover. I killed him. I shot him in the foot. Rest in peace, my friend. <laughs> That's two for two. I've really fucked up. And I got another baller twins. Okay, so it seems like maybe those people fighting, at least one of them, was a gang member that, you know, his death was not that bad. But... How do I... Why is there no tutorial pop-up that tells me how to do this? Let's take a look here. Controls. Okay. Punch. Oh, so I do I... I have to... Use the quick... Item thing and... Unarm myself before I can punch? That's probably what it is. Yikes. All right. The learning curve is, it's, it's something, right? You know, riding shotgun on foot. Okay. <clears throat> Moving on. Moving on then. So this, no. Mm. Okay. Yeah, like, I don't have a lasso, I don't have anything that I, you know, would would deem to be appropriate for the situation, really. So I would just have to go to my fist, and then I can beat him. So I'm gonna have to remember to do that. Well, you know, he seems like he was a bad- he was a bad man. He was a bad man. So... <laughs> You know, I'm not saying we should be proud, but I'm still getting thanked at the end of the day. I'm still getting cash money, so. All right. Um. So I know I went up to Bonnie's house and I can't see her till 5 a.m. What time is it? Um. It's not, it's, is it not? Hold on. 5 a.m. and 6 p.m. All right. Well, shit, I can't sleep again, because then that'll be, um, it'll be too long. Well, Charlie, I appreciate you not ratting on me when I absolutely murdered those two people in cold, bu cold blood, but he will remember it. Hello? Actually come in here. Is there any, like, bounty type stuff? It's kind of crazy that they have this whole self-contained, like, system going on in just this little ranch. It's very impressive. How's the economy? Dog be dog. Which one's Charlie? I mean, it's probably this one, but... Okay, now it's five. Great, let's go. Bonnie, I did kill someone right in front of your property. 
I'm oh, sure Mr. she Marston. heard it. How are you? Good, Miss McFarland. How are you? I'm well. Would you mind riding with me to Armadillo? I've got to get some supplies and I could do with the company. Of course. You can take the reins. It wouldn't do for a terrifying bounty hunter such as yourself to be seen driven around by a woman. Hop <laughs> <laughs> on uh. up, Mr. Marston. We gonna be shooting? Oh, of course, the driver's seat. Why am I? Oh, right, because she said it'd be stupid for a woman to drive. It's fair. Would be stupid. You're looking much better, considering you were almost buzzard food a couple days ago. I have you to thank for that, miss. So do tell me, have you needlessly risked your life since we last spoke? No, Is this miss, not a wolf? I have not. Well, that's a relief. Perhaps there's hope for you yet. I wouldn't bet on it. Oh, there's always hope, Mr. Marston. You can't be a rancher in this kind of country if you don't believe that. An admirable attitude, miss. I suppose so. I can't think of any other way to stay sane, to be frank. What about you? Have you ever given up hope altogether? Hope hasn't really entered into it. It's not really something I think about. A peculiar outlook. I can't really say I understand you. I can't I'm a practical always man. say I do either. Oh, don't be so deliberately enigmatic. I'm not, miss. Yes, you are. You are being deliberately obscure as a substitute for having a personality. <laughs> I just know there are two theories to arguing with women. And neither one works. I'm not even going to dignify that gibberish with a response. Call him out. He's being a pussy. He's not saying anything. Good on you, Bonnie. All right, let's let's. You never uh, did tell me where you live. I have a small holding up in Great Plains. A farmer? Yeah, and I'm the Queen of England. And at what point during your day of hunting down outlaws do you find time to raise chickens? Only been at it three years or so. I guess I'm kind of okay. new to it. You're telling me? So who's looking after this farm of yours right now? Uncle. Well, he's not my uncle, as far as I know. Just an old dog who's as lazy as a lizard on a hot day. Kind of fella laboring under the delusion that age brings wisdom. Uh, sounds like the perfect person to leave in charge of your entire livelihood. We go way back. And I didn't have a lot of choice. I'd be getting back there if I was you. That's what I'm trying to do, miss. I just gotta quickly do this one thing. Where's Charles? I guess Charles is always kind of busy How doing well other do stuff. How you know New Austin? I don't. We talked about coming down here many times, but never made it. Who's we? Me and the folks I used to, used to work with. Yeah, New Austin. The last real outlaw country. Where the old ways still hold true. Do a man wrong, he'll shoot you for it. Do a man right? Well, he still may shoot you for it. But at least you have an idea of what's right and what's wrong here. Dear, oh dear, Mr. Marston. What dreadful novel did you get that romanticized drivel out of? Those days are long gone if they were ever here at all. According to Paul, those days were just people shooting each other because they lost the cards. We'll be lucky if our ranch survives another five years. Businessmen are the new cowboys. Uh. How do you do, sir? Okay. Here we go. I feel like all of that stuff would have fell out of the back. So this is Armadillo. One, Manhattan it is not. But it does okay for us. important thing for you right now is getting yourself into Dr. Johnson's office to purchase some medicine. The first one's on me. Thank you, miss. I'll pay you back. I'm sure you shall. The doc's a good fellow. He saved your life, so be polite to him. I have $63. Store when you're done. I should just be giving it all to you. I don't need to add to my tab. Weird. Weird. Hey, doc. Excellent to see you today. To them, Thank you. How are you, friend? You need something for that gout? Why? I don't have gout. Why are you assuming I have gout? He doesn't even recognize me. Any meds, laudanum, adrenaline, or pills? Why, thank you. All right, thanks for your generic conversing. 
I don't need it though. Do I have to? For story based reasons? Let's see, let's see what Bonnie says. When I start red, you will die. Yep, that's well, already happened. Thanks for driving me. It was nice to be able to enjoy the view for once. And the little company never hurts now and again. You're more than welcome, miss. Least I can do. Thank you for the medicine. Why don't you have a look around Armadillo? You can always take a stagecoach back to the ranch later. I might just do that. Travel safely, miss. Try not to get yourself shot. I won't be around to save you this time. Who knows? You could pop up anywhere. Seems like you you know what's going on or something. It's strange. Well, that was a whole load of nothing. Thought we were gonna get some action. Stagecoaches. <gasps> Music. Okay, I think I'm gonna end this on a really like a lameish note, but I think as I get more and more like into the game, I'll be more comfortable just going out and doing more side quests and stuff. Obviously, I need to get better at combat. I'm so sorry that was really um, terrible, really awful. But I'm so excited to play this game. I'm so excited to see what happens to John because I don't know anything and. Seems like if we're already dealing with Bill, I wonder if we're gonna run into other people. Um, so I'm trying to think about the fates of everybody. It was like... I'm trying to think of every single gang member and what happened to them and stuff. And it's a little bit blurry, but there are some people that I wonder... I ponder as to where they are now, so... I'm looking forward to running into them, hopefully. Um, otherwise, yeah, I know this might have come out a little bit unexpected because I was talking about playing different games, particularly The Last of Us 2. Um, honestly, I don't feel like I'm in the headspace to play that game. From my opinion, from what I've heard about it, is it just seems like it's, it's like a really good story, but it's very, um, hard emotionally and i'm just not really up to that right now i want to play something a little bit more i mean i don't know where this story is gonna go but i don't i just don't feel like it right now i'm not in that headspace so we maybe i will be later on but right now it's not in the cards for me so hopefully you guys understand but it's not completely off the table it just is right now so anyway if you are still here, thank you so much for watching. You could have clicked on any video, but you clicked on mine and I really appreciate it. I hope you guys have a good day and I will see you next time. Bye guys.